All right, so philosophy number 10 is going to be if you are miserable during the process, you won't keep the results that you get. So yeah, after maybe three months of really grinding really hard and doing a lot of cardio, a lot of weightlifting, a lot of restricting calories, you might lose 30, 40, 50 pounds depending on how much weight you have to lose, which is great. That shows that you're motivated. But if the methods that you used are not sustainable, like we talked about earlier, then you're not going to keep that weight off because you're gonna go back to your old habits. So if every single day is a complete pain in the ass and you don't ever have some sort of break where you start to enjoy the process, you start to feel good in the moment, your quality of life starts to actually improve, then you're not going to keep the results that you attain. So while being motivated to get results is awesome and you should definitely have that, if you don't do things that help you maintain those results, what are you doing? This is why it's always more important to start off small and to start off with an easy habit to focus on than it is to get caught up in how much weight you're losing. Because a lot of times when we lose a lot of weight doing a specific thing, if that specific thing isn't maintainable, if we can't do that after we're done trying to lose weight, then we're not gonna keep that weight off. And probably the most frustrating part about losing weight is gaining it back. So wouldn't you rather go a little bit slower, lose a little bit less weight at a time, but keep that weight off permanently? I think you do. So make sure that you are enjoying some part of the process. You don't have to enjoy it every single day, right? but you have to consistently see the value in it and see how your life is improving as a result. If after two months you can't see the benefit of what you're doing, you need to take a step back and reevaluate the rate at which you are trying to lose weight. And sometimes you need to focus on something other than your weight because of how frustrating tracking your weight can be. So again, focus on the habits, focus 